All right, guys, just here this morning. Um, it's a day out from when uh, me and the family were heading away up to Cape for three weeks. So I've been putting together a bit of a bit of a package for us to stay in for the next three weeks. So I just wanted to give you a quick run through of what I got. Um, so I've got our basic, you know, the camping outback series, what we're using to take away. Obviously, you can see a few advantages just quickly. Straighter, straighter sides on these things so you get more storage space as you can see I've done an actual just a false floor that comes in over the top so I can stack on top and put all my kitchen kitchen area and fridges and so on and so forth underneath you've got um, yeah pl plenty of room in top for your your um, all your front runner boxes or swags or whatever you want to use basically everyone's set up's different I've been running just your compressor up the front here with obviously um, your outlets on the side um, little caps to go over those, a few things like that. Set up a set up a good light, lighting systems on the side and up in under the doors. Just 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 trialing the stuff out. So um, if you move around, give you a quick quick look at the kitchen setup. So I've just I've, I've run two fridges here because I want enough for the beer and and you know a lot of a lot of food. So we're we're going away for a bit. It's not ideal for everyone set up. Obviously you get away with one fridge, but I just wanted to try it and see how we went. Yeah, obviously pantry, we've got drawers, storage drawers for, you know, bits and pieces, you, you know, whatever, whatever you're taking away. But top, bottom, plenty of space. Then you've got a slider pull out your pantry side of it, which um, comes out over your fridge and your, your kitchen area. That can just lift up. I've got all my you know, staples and cooker and all that kind of stuff in here. And it just pushes in out of the way while you're not... Um, while you're not using it, obviously access to your fridge over the top, fridge freezer set up, and then just get yeah, your bench space, bench space here, bench space here. You've got a turnout and a storage space under there. So it's it's a pretty pretty easy quick setup to be able to use while we're on the run, set up, set down, especially up the cape where you're moving moving most days. So um, come around the side, obviously you got your. <coughs> Basically, we'll access the tent from this side with with our setup, which is uh, you know the norm. Obviously, side access on all, all of our camping products. Uh, I'm the fun. I'm actually trialling on this one. I've got a front rack which I run on the Outback series, which we can run on the Outback series because they're a stronger chassis rather than your traditional rooftop tent. Um, so I'm trialling this up the Cape. I've got them on a couple of vehicles, so we'll we'll give it a run and see how we go, and we'll we'll, we'll let you know when we get back. But um, yeah, just standard. This one's got a water, water tap, or water pumped into the top. It runs down to a um, to a tank on the inside here. Obviously, got the tank up the front in front of all the all the kitchen setup. It's got a pump underneath there, which just runs out the back, so you can actually access access your tap at the back near your kitchen. So as it, as it starts to um, shower here, I suppose I, I could. I was going to give you, a, I'll give you a quick rundown of what, how long it's going to take me to set it down and hopefully, you know, hopefully I don't get too wet. Alright, first thing I'll take this away.
easy. By the back normally, if you've got your ladder set up, you can bring it around. I don't have it there, but you can also, on these ones, you can also use your tailgate. Pretty simple. Jump up. Literally as simple as that, and then you're on the right, off the up the track. So we'll test her out, see how it goes, and I'll let you know when we get back. Cheers, guys.